Uh, yes, more, Jeb. This is a long game. <laughs> this is cute fuzzy <laughs> goes home. <laughs> this is cute fuzzy weasel. Welcome to part four or five. Whatever part this is. What in God's name is wrong with that sandwich? <laughs> it looks like someone took a dump in the turkey. <laughs> oh God, and music again. The general Hospital is down the road by the lake. It's too far to walk. Come on, get in the car. If I'm riding in a car, George, I prefer to be the driver. Yeah, we both see how you drive. What are you talking about? You don't even know how to get there. Which is another good reason for me to drive, George. I need to learn my way around town. Very well. Then I'll ride with you. Go. I want to keep an eye on you. Take it out. Fair enough. And sit straight. Hang it upside down. Just one thing, Agent Morgan. Your involvement in this case is okay. limited. That means you don't have to run your way around town. <laughs> and now, now the, the saxophone George, cuts in. Better get moving. The hospital closes at 2800. Wait, wait, now it's over. Wait, the hospital closes? Shouldn't the hospital be an all day sort of thing? We're only in episode one. Yes, we have only covered one ep We haven't even covered one episode. I hate you. Just because you have a badge. I hate you so much. How much did this game cost you? Twenty dollars. Seriously? Yes. Agent York is in the. What's wrong with the car? This game was seriously twenty bucks. Why is there electricity arcing off the back window? I don't know. Well then, Agent York, let's get going. Sure. Maybe it's raining. It's right. Oh. Okay. Yay. The rain looks really, really bad. See how awesome it is to drive the car, Jeb? Don't you like it? God, how do I get out? Hey, you got a medal for being bad at driving. Hey, 
Space Monopoly board. <laughs> Actually, no. I was thinking it's more like spin the bottle, but with a dirty needle. Okay, um... Wait, you're supposed to drive through here? Yeah, you're supposed to drive through there. Oh my god. No, we can't read signs, game. Well, the texture's got a new reason. Son of a bitch! It did! Oh, that's a... That, 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 Oh. <laughs> he thought that was his coat, too. Can you imagine now, though, isn't it? My mother always talked about how energetic this town used to be. Almost like a gold rush, she used to say. Impressive. Oh, we should play next. Deserves country ham. It's really salty and will help with your dehydration. Hello, Sarah. Good God! <laughs> it's a Terminator. Doctor Johnson is in the computer room. What is wrong with her? Is it prosthetic? Computer. During that no. Time, you two. I'm FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. How did you know I was FBI? <laughs> Easy. None of the police in this town wear cologne. So you just guessed he was FBI because he smells different? I think she is a Terminator. <laughs> it's an exaggerated business spread, even in the countryside. What's that you're reading, if I may ask? A book! <laughs> Liar's House? You haven't heard of this yet? It's a recent bestseller mystery. It's set in the U.S., a small, traditional North American... Her bottles are literally Coke. Her glasses are Coke bottles! You can even see the rim in them! That peaceful town shattered by terrible crime. Seriously, wait till it gets back in her face! And that okay. incident causes grief and sadness to everyone in town. But everyone feels the seditious, heinous, evil still oh, shut up, by. Yes, much like the situation right now, you right now. Don't say that. Oh, sorry, I shouldn't have said that. I'm not dead and all. Don't worry. Books are written to entertain. It's good you're enjoying. What we're faced with here is a terrible crime committed in a real world. Much different from that of a novel. So there's no need to apologize. Thank you, Amy. See? They are Coke bottles! Oh my god! They're Coke bottles! If she's blind, she won't see this. <laughs> Yay! Shooter! Shooter face! Shooter in the chest and face! Yay! We're the good guys! You're a winner! You won! Alright, now put your gun away. Wait five seconds and... Observe. Just observe. Should go back to being okay. Trust me. <laughs> Short term memory is a problem for these folks. We. So I've totally lost track of any objective here. Uh, just follow the red thing and go through the wall. Right, go to the door. Open the door. It doesn't appear to be locked. Does every door need to make a creaking sound? Yes, because this is an old, decrepit, creeping house. This game's making me nauseous. And angry. Angry. This game is like pregnancy. Or anxious. 
Well, the door here is on fire, so. Does the doctor know what the game's finding? What do you mean? The chess tournament. And a card key already set in place. The king passes the rook and meets the bishop. Knight takes a pawn along for the queen. What does that all mean? It's a simple puzzle. Zach, let's take him up on his challenge. You can do this, right? I should probably take this. Oh, great, a puzzle. Yay! King passes rook, meets a bishop, the angel of the queen. You can't do this to us, game. It's not fair. Jeb, tell him it's not fair. The world is laughing at us. Checkmate! <laughs> ah, what the hell? Agent York died a long time ago. Inside, it's all black and greasy. Another code? But there's nowhere to insert a password. More games. I'm going to get Maybe he's right downstairs now. in the morgue. No need, George. The message appeared with the card key. It's telling us where to use it. This is not the time to be joking around, Agent Morgan. I don't think this man Dr. knows what the word joke means. Below with the deceased. With Anna. Below being underground, I take it. Simple. Simple. How did he bend his arm that way? I hate this game. Then it's time to meet the mischievous architect of this little game. Ah. Uh. Is <laughs> my nose bleeding? For once, the music is actually kind of acceptable. You got a major clue, and so follow it. Yeah, I can kind of get in on this. Go a little faster pace. Come on, run. Yeah, the killer's inside the hospital. Go, go, go. What the f is that? What's on the TV? Nuclear vision? I don't know. Who cares? Let's go, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> things to do with his life, like play a full round of the Justin Bieber board game! Hey. What? Don't insult Justin Bieber with this game, it's that bad! Okay, let's go see an autopsy. Aww, what? The guy's behind the door! Shoot the lockout! Apparently your bullets do nothing. Well, alright. You obviously have to look at the body that's behind you. Or wail on the door. No. Uh. Uh. How come there's 
particle effects for hitting the door with a pipe, but not with a bullet. Observe. Shelves for storing bodies. I wouldn't open these unless we really need to. Let me guess. If I observe the other thing, throw away? Observe. Shelves for storing bodies. I, then why have more than one observation thing if it only... Well, I'm lost. I don't know where the hell to go. I hate you. I hate you so much for this. I'll pay you back. This is... No, you can't buy my life back. I'll buy a dinner or something. Uh, get a... Get a medal for almost looking at dead bodies. Yay! Johnson, the doctor in this hospital. Oh, sure, Johnson. Francis York Morgan. Please call me York. Everyone, Everyone calls me that. She's shaking Very it. Well. She is aware of how bad this game is. Are you a forensic practitioner? Let's just say I've dealt with corpses before. Okay, well, that doesn't mean that, that was a lot of things. Did you create that yourself? Mm hmm. I just wanted to see if our FBI agent could handle the task. I see. I'm jealous. It was pretty fun. I'm glad you liked it. That was her hair defined. You don't have much like time. That. Well, you does her hair have rigor? Yeah, she has muscle fibers in her hair. That would explain a lot about Japanese Next culture. Time, try challenging us without obstructing an investigation. You've angered the monarch. <laughs> he calls him uh, Mark. Alright, so... I'm coming for you, Ventura! From the onset of rigor mortis <laughs> and the stiffening of the muscles, the time of death is estimated to be between 20 and 2200 hours. Now, that's still quite early for such a crime to take place. Note that there are two exterior wounds. Pressure marks around the neck and a long cut running from chest to abdomen. skin cells from the attacker. She also doesn't appear to have been bound or badly beaten. But she was cut open. She was apparently killed without resistance. The most tragic thing, however, was that she was unable to speak her story to anyone who could hear her cries. Uh, okay, dude. We get it, you're being cryptic. Stop it, game. Well, I guess we all know who killed her. Yeah, she did it. She the did it. The cut out his tongue. Well, I believe she was drugged first, 
to face her consciousness, and then the killer killed her. The killer killed her. Killer killed her. Killer killer. Killer killer. The killer, killer, killer most killer. likely has a deep. What appropriate music for studying a dead body. Probably cannot converse with them normally. Cutting out the trunk. <laughs> Accompanied by the ending song, Blue Moon. George, would you mind? You know, I'm starting to get so, this guy's a movie buff. What more do you hope to find? You know what I think? I think the movies. I'm sure I mentioned that I have plot. a personal interest. You know what I think? Like what? I think he murdered those girls. Really? I'm starting to suspect it. You have to look. Use. His age isn't immediately apparent, though he can't be that old. Looks like a trustworthy doctor. Look down. You gotta look down more. You gotta look down more. Look down more. Look around, Jab. Is that as low as you can go? standing here pointing to their face we wouldn't stare at her for too long shouldn't heh <laughs> get it she's attractive in a non-attractive sort of way ah, there's some feet body is laying on the table yeah I hope so I what hope the hell are we observing we're observing maybe that Oh, she's got symbols burned in her face hands. Judging from the impressions, she was holding something in her hand. A necklace. But it was removed about six hours after death. The object was circular with a relief <coughs> shape like a piece mark. Like that necklace that crying chick was holding. Observe. Observe his crotch. He knows what's happening. Yeah. We both killed her. Yay! Now, did I remember to hide that last body? Ah, uh, who knows. Ah, oh, hell, it's gonna bug me all day till I figure it out. What you looking at? I'm gonna kick your ass next. Where will I hide your body? Ah, uh, fuck it. He did! He just went... <laughs> Wait, observe. Beautiful blonde hair. They spelled blonde wrong. Did Stunning. you write this game? <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. Stunning even in death. He's getting turned on by your body. Traces of evaporated liquid around the... Wait, did... You can see where liquid was? Well, it's not unreasonable. I don't know, maybe. The tongue has been removed. Look at the edge of the stump. I can't. You won't let me zoom in. For viewers at home, just be aware, me and Jeb have been playing all the parts you've been watching 
at once. We started at, what, 6.30? It's now 9.10. We've been playing this game all night. I hate you. I really... Really From her lack of resistance, I'd say that Anna's injuries happened very quickly. Unable to speak, she was then left to cry herself to death. What? And then the eyes it's all open. starting to come together. The perpetrator stayed with her for at least two hours until it stopped raining. She bled out for two hours from at an the estimated open time of her death. It was still raining. She must have had but a lot of blood in her. Tear marks on her cheeks. That means she was killed under a roof somewhere. Hmm. She was then carried into the woods after it stopped raining. Hmm. <laughs> There's one other thing. Her tongue was removed with a very blunt knife. In fact, it's more likely it was simply chopped off. No! What? No! What? Explain to me how one chops off a tongue. Well, I imagine you'd stretch it. Oh, God, wait, did you hit the thing to skip something? I don't know anymore. Wait, now you're in a hospital and the things are in it. Are we tripping balls again? Zach, they're here. Who? to kill dead Anna. Ray, something's happening. I don't care that it's terrible. At least something is happening. <laughs> you know what you have to do, Jeff? You have, myself. you have to walk around the hospital till you find someone. Ah, there we go. There's Anna. Go kill her. No, we were the murderer. Yeah, we're the murderer. We killed Anna. We have to go kill her again. This is the weirdest episode of The Sweet Life of Zack and Cody I've ever seen. Well, you know. Maybe this is why they canceled that show. Is this Baywatch now? A really sick version of Baywatch. I don't care, though, because like I said, at least stuff is happening. That, see? Something is happening. At least something is happening. Purple boy. Oh, 
it's lighting up. Yeah, you should probably take a, a, a first aid kit. Oh my god, like there's you. side missions. <laughs> yeah. Who thought this was a good idea? Wait, what the fuck? The deer's alive!
Jesus Christ. God, son. Come on, come on. Go up the stairs.
It's awesome. I'm literally falling asleep over here. It's so dark in this room. I'm gonna fall asleep. I'm afraid to drive when I get home. I'm gonna get into an accident. <laughs> it's gonna be all this game's fault. Thanks, Japan. <laughs> Thanks, Obama. <laughs> Alright, so that's a great game, but where do I go now? Wait, oh no. Oh no. I just had a thought, Jeb. What if this was a side quest? Oh no. 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 God, I hope not. Where did I come from? I must have. Oh god, it was. It was. Seriously consider it. This game is that bad. Game. I'm not sure we should even call this a game. Is this a game? Or is this, this is a long, slow torture? Maybe this is death. You died. And this game is your journey through purgatory or hell. That's it. Where's the opt out form? I'm gonna opt out of an afterlife and this is what happens. Oh no, not the sheriff who made those great cookies. This one behind me, is it? No. They're not pulling that shot yet. Oh no, there's so many. However, will I deal with these many zombies? It evaporates from the screen. Make sure there's nothing over there. You know, this is a problem in survival horror. Giving your character unlimited ammo and a gun that can easily shoot a target at long range. Like, it's so scary. Their AI is so terrible.